That's a good one. It's hard to believe that something that big hit that light. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, wow, that's a beautiful fish. Nice cat, Brad. It's one of these. Uh, We're out here fishing one of these kind of fall. Whoa, come here, baby. Fall transition periods. And it's not quite cold enough to get these fish into their winter quarters yet. We're still fishing some of the classic late summer kind of spots. Yeah, they're kind of, I don't know what you would call them. They're, they're kind of in between. They're yeah. not really anywhere, yeah. but they're everywhere, so yep. to speak. And they're definitely acting like it's fall in they cooler are. water, they the are. way they're biting. Yep, they're biting kind of soft, but um, just kind of be patient with them. And uh, once you feel that weight, when they commit a little bit, then it's time to go have yep. fun with them. <laughs> yep. Patience is a virtue you on this spice. That is a beautiful fish. Very good. Whoa! So this, this spot here we're fishing is basically we have a, we're kind of coming around an outside bend and we're coming in and this is a main river channel right here. Yep, we're, we're coming off a deep hole that's cut into an outside cut. So it's real deep in one spot and real shallow up, up on the edges and we're trying to find them on the highway aggressively yeah. feeding is yep. what we're doing here. Yep. You bet. There's got to be another one wandering around down there. There you go. Something's weird going on. Here we go, Brett. Got one here. There we go. You know, Brad, like you were saying, this time of year, you can kind of hopscotch around different types of spots. And, you know, we tried a few classic wood piles and so on. And, and in this case, Got a nice mid-river mid -river hole, nice little channel cutting up. We're hitting the tail water and down in the channel. You know, it comes off of a big hole and a, and a shallow run. It's actually classic. Yeah. It's actually classic, and it's it's channeled in here from flooding as basically a feeding chute. Oh, there we go. Come on, fishy. Good boil. Yeah. Good boil. Another nice one. Nice one. Woohoo! All right. Nice fish. All right. Oh, that's a good fish Another there. Beautiful channel cat. Look at that. You know, looking at big fish like that just never gets old. No. Never ever gets old. There we go. It's a 33 inch. Very nice quality fish. World class, you know. This is a special channel cat here, that's for sure. Well, that's what we've become known for up here. Yeah. And I'll, I, you know, I always tell people it's the finest channel cat fishing on the yeah. continent. You, you don't believe it till you see it. No, it's unbelievable. Boy, the fishing can't get any, any more simple, can it? Standard slip sinker rig. A hook, some line, a swivel in yeah. the middle for twisting, and No roll sinker, that. in this case three ounces. Uh, heavy duty uh, barrel swivel, about an eight inch leader. Tied to, in this case, a troll car, uh, laser troll car octopus hook. hook. Extremely sharp, extremely surgically sharp hook. Um, there's some other options too. Circle hooks are another option yep. out here. Um, but in this case, this is definitely doing the job. It doesn't take much to get that to stick. No, I know that from my fingers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with that, I'm gonna go find us some frozen suckers. I carry a lot of bait. It's kind of funny. A lot of guys will not use frozen bait. And there's certain days and certain times a year where frozen bait is just magical. And fall time is one of those times. Uh, which apparently switching over to some frozen suckers actually is out producing fresh suckers right now. All right, we need a new spot. Let's go. Sweet. What a cool spot. That's good. That's a pretty classic wood pile. Shallow wood. Kind of new for this day. So what bait do you like out here? I see you got gold eye, sucker, frogs. I'm very partial to sucker. Sucker is by far my go-to bait. But not every day is it the right bait either. Yeah. So you gotta be prepared with all of it. Oh, there's oh, a fish. There you go. Ah, that's a nice one. That's oh, a good yeah. one. Nice bread. Nice hit. Nice, nice, nice. You know, the setup's perfect. This is an eight foot. The ugly stick catfish is an eight foot medium heavy. It's got a nice soft tip, but it's got some backbone to handle these big fish. 6500 C3 is doing its job, the Yabu. And the Suffolk Siege is uh, performing pretty well in a lot of this thick cover today. There's really nothing that this setup can't deal with yeah. as far as these channels go. All right, here we go. Oh, yeah. Real nice fish. There we go. 
Nice, Brad. All right. Very nice. Woohoo! That's the one I was waiting for, there right go. there. That's a specimen of a channel cat. That is. That guy wasn't getting off. Where well, that troll car found home pretty good, right in the corner. Oh, oh very, very good, Brad. Nice, nice channel cat. A nice ball channel cat, too.